Hey everybody, welcome back to Must Be Online to do the video. So today Must Be introduce you another new machine, new model for DPF printing, named Focus Nebula 35F model. So as you know, there are two kind of different, three, actually it's three kind of different DPF printer in the market right now. First one is the big size, 60 centimeter. That model named Focus 62F with Epson 2, two Epson 4720 print head or or the Epson i3200 print head. That's for mass production, for industrial printing. But also, uh, as some customers, they require a small size, like a, like a desktop printers. It can put on the on at home, at home or at, at office with small size, small room. So, therefore, we have the new desktop A3 size DTI printer. But also for uh, three A3 three sets, there are also another model with Epson modified printers, like uh, Epson L, L, L1800, uh, or the Epson, L3, the Epson 1390 printer. They use the modified Epson printers. They modify to detailed printing. But that, print, that modified printer only has one print head. It's only one print head, and one print head maximal is eight channel or normally six channel. If the cheap one is only six channel, for that printers only have one print head, but this printer we have two print head, two unique print head. One for printing with one ink, and another one for printing with color ink. But why we put two Epson print head for printing DTF? Because for printing on the DTF film, we require the better white ink density and also the better print quality. But if we use the modified printers like Epson L1900 or Epson 1390, these kind of modified printers, because this, this is Epson made for print on the paper for office using. So if we put this kind of machine for print DTF, we cannot get a good print quality, especially for the wet end base. It's the density is really worse. And also the past line, the past line is very really clear. And the pass line impression is really clearly. So the printing quality is not it's not good. Also, as you know, the biggest headache for uh, modified printers because the modified modified printers they don't have the printing width for DTF ink. So if we print for DTF, the printing quality is really good. It's, it's not good. It's worse. And also the big headache is for the chips because the original Epson printers, they used to for print the paper, but we, but somebody they take it for modified to print the DTF. So they must crack some chips for the sensors, loss of sensor, like paper rod sensor, like the feed sensor, like the ink chips, ink cartridge chips sensor. So it's not stable, lots of headaches once you got the modified printers. Because, because we cannot get the original firmware and change the firmware for this kind of original Epson printers. And also for the desktop Epson modified printers, it cannot support the ICC profile. So if you take it for print DTF, the color rendition is not good because you cannot change any ICC profile. Even you use the echo rip or some rip on the market. So the the color rendition, the rapid, all are not some good, not original. So anyway, I, I think must be think this is not smart choice or not the best choice to take a modified Epson printers if you really want to do a good business for DTF printing to get a good results. So lots of customers, friends ask Master B if we have these kind of printers. Yes, we have. This is the Nebula 35F is for the desktop DTF printing with high quality and also mass production. So this printer we put two Epson F1080 print head. We can put two, one for white, one for color. For, be, for get the best printing, white ink printing quality and also for get the best uh, color ink printing because one head have six channel. 
so we can have good white ink and also color ink printing result. And also this industrial using. Inside we can see there are lots of all the spare parts we made from we made for industrial labor, but not the modified printers, as the paper desktop printers. We can see the, the rear is for aluminum, and also the, also the linear rear, as, and also the, the, the vacuum absorption, absorption table, and also the, the pinch lower, the motor, and the printing carriage, all are made, all are made from for industrial labor, even it is small, but it's industrial labor. So all we do it is just for let the own customer can have a good machine printed with stable and with good quality. Also the cap station is up down motion. So there are too much advantages for this kind of industrial labor, small desktop A3 size DTF printer. And also it, it match with one small size, the powder processing system. Even it's small, but it's powerful. We can see they have all the functions that the bigger powder supply system, uh, the powder processing system have, like the dusting system, the shaking system, the baking system, and the low feed device, take up device. So all are for industrial product, for industrial configuration. And also you can see must be is not so tall, but this machine is shorter than must be. You can guess how 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 height for must be, maybe 1.8. But this this machine you can see is to my west, so it's very small. And for the lens, maybe two must be for the lens, but not so fat. If I'm fat, maybe just one must be for the for the width of the machine. And also it has one legger. This leg is not, is not for configuration, not for standard configuration, because some customer, they can put this machine for the desk, for on the desk. So no need, no need this, the, the shear, no need these leggers. So this is just the for sure, not for, but if we want to buy, also we have for sale. So this machine also look the nice, all right? The acrylic cover, and also the control panel, the white ink, the white ink, Struling system and the white ink circulation system all are for standard, standard configuration. Okay, so this is the, the whole view and why the focus Nebula 35F comes to the market. Later, must we teach you how to install and how to use this machine to get a good DTF printed result. So, just for must be. Thank you.